Hi, I'm Bree Balchunas, and this is the Orlando Health News Review for August 12th. A recent visit to Winnie Palmer Hospital's neonatal intensive care unit shows a behind the scenes look at how this team cared for our tiniest patients and their families by donating their own wedding dresses to be converted into bereavement and baptismal gowns. Traditionally, the wedding gowns are other people's wedding gowns, um, but one of my nurses, Karen Brewer, she decided that it would be nice if we donated our wedding gowns. It is even more meaningful that our nurses are giving back something to our babies that they've cared for all these years. I'm greatly appreciative of all the nurses and the staff that have donated their wedding dresses. I know for the girls it's a joyous occasion when they get married and to th for them to see their dresses be put into use here. It creates a, a positive memory out of a bad situation to have this memento of their baby and the time that they were with their baby. People don't realize that the NICU exists until you have to have our services so I think that when we actually bring them a gown which is something that they never thought that they would have to get I feel like it means it means to them that there's people that do care this is an exceptional example of how Orlando Health cares honors and respects our patients and families thank you to the Winnie Palmer Hospital NICU team if you would like to recognize this team or anyone at Orlando Health, log on to Applause Central today and send them a kudos, honors, or nominate them as an Orlando Health champion. Speaking of the NICU, this year the Alexander Center for Neonatology at Winnie Palmer Hospital will celebrate its 40th anniversary, marking four decades of compassionate care and treatment for critically ill babies born in Central Florida. In celebration, the inaugural Walk for Winnie presented by Pranera Bread and hosted by SeaWorld Orlando will be held Saturday, September 12th. This fun-filled family affair, which includes a one-mile walk through SeaWorld Orlando prior to the park opening, supports the NICU and helps patients like Maya. One morning at 4 o'clock or 4.30 in the morning, uh, they came in and um, they just said we had to deliver. We have 20 minutes, we're going to deliver the baby. Um, and we have to do it if you want to see either one of them. Um, and we had our daughter Maya. My name is Maya Thiru and I'm 11 years old. And I weigh 1 pound and 14 ounces. And I was in the hospital for 110 days. I'm excited to walk for Winnie because I'm excited to see other parents and other kids just like me. There is no cost to participate in the event. Check out SWIFT for all the details or visit walkforwinnie.com. That's it for today's edition. For the Orlando Health News Review, I'm Brie Balchunas.